thought I'd take a quick moment to let you guys know that they perform exceptionally well in the rain. They're doing good. No spinning, no slippage. I like them. They're super quiet still. A thousand miles on them. And they're still extremely quiet, still not making any road noise. I dare say that these might be. Well, we'll find out. It we'll find out be, on the trail. Yeah. As far as roadworthy goes, they're the best tires that we've put on this thing so far. It might as well just be a straight all-terrain, but they have aggressive lugs, so we're going to see how they do. Off-road. Off-road. And hopefully they perform as well as they do on-road. <laughs> I'm editing footage while we're driving, and I was so busy editing footage that I almost forgot <laughs> to record video for this video. Okay, so where are we, Kevin? <laughs> Don't know. We just left Leadville. Leadville. About 10,200 feet. We stayed overnight. And we are now heading to. Dun, 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 Holy Cross! Which Jesus. we couldn't think of any better trail to test out the 38s for the very first time. This is the first time we will have these tires off road. So, yeah, prediction. How do you think they'll do? So far, they've done everything great. So, I, I think they're going to do well. They've uh, done Holy everything Cross, great on the road. On the road. So, there's apparently one obstacle in particular. Cleveland Rock. If you watch YouTube videos, you see a lot of mostly super built Jeeps or like buggies going up this thing. Obviously, we would like to try it, but supposedly we've just found out that if you go up it, you also have to go down it. We've been told there isn't a bypass and we are 100% all for going up that thing, or at least attempting to go up it to see if the Jeep can do it. We're not 100% for going down it. There are a lot of videos of built jeeps and buggies nearly flipping or actually flipping going down this thing so we'll see when we get to that point if we are uh, stupid enough to give it a shot but knowing us <laughs> i kid you not this thing is awesome escalate i just don't know how we're gonna follow that might as well just well, it quits now. So we had a couple of stragglers in the group still trying to unload off of a trailer. <laughs> Plus one for driving our Jeep to and from all of the trails. So we're gonna jump on ahead and see if we can't catch up to that rowdy Escalade. We're curious, that thing looked cool. We want a closer look, so we're gonna try to play catch up. The beginning of this trail so far, I mean, it isn't by any means difficult per se, but it's definitely not for the faint of heart either. Yeah. Zero scraping, scraping on anything right there. On right anything. Was... No tire slip. They fold it over on the rock pretty well too, so. Is it silly that you'd be like excited about excited tires? excited about tires? <laughs> Not when you have our particular illness. Oh, do we have a disease now? Oh, we definitely have a disease. Oh. We're sick in the head. There's no okay. getting around it. There you go. Lock up. Easy. Slider. No, you're good. You're going over. on that big truck? Yeah. Holy cow. So although we haven't hit any of the main obstacles yet, so far the 38 seem to be a pretty good size. We are scraping on next to nothing. <laughs> Beyond this point, the road goes from moderate to difficult. Vehicle body mechanical damage is likely. Please do not exceed your limitations. Vehicle recovery will be costly. Kevin, it says do not exceed our limitations. I don't know what those are. God, look. You see those tires? Let me cut up to the Escalade. He's got some flex, too. That thing is so rad. Anything you I can do it. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I'm just kidding. We probably couldn't. Unless you count in Kevin's pit bull style determination and stubbornness and my spotting skills. Then actually maybe. Maybe we could. Who knows? Never say never. Speaking of pit bulls, that's what the Escalade is running. The pit bull rocker radials. Oh, Looks yeah, like look. they're in a 42 inch maybe. I can't tell obviously from behind But they left 30 minutes before us on this trail and we caught up to them now There is four of them, but they're all way more built than our Jeep So that means we're gonna take the exact same line that Oh, they do. 
I'm going on a diet because I got this like fat head cheek stuff. And plus she's so freaking hot on camera and I look like her, as people say, your your dad. For those no, of you I don't, actually. I don't who have been doubting it, Kevin and I are married. He is my husband, he is not my father. I also don't have a big bank account. And if I was to play baseball, my cup size would be small. So. <laughs> Make it clearance wise, but I 100% guarantee you'll make this. You gonna give the middle a shot? No, nah, put your uh, driver on here. Yeah, that's the easy side. Either go up this left side over here, or you're coming, coming up this side. Don't pussy out. too far to the driver's side anyways. You get a little tippy on the other side. Oh, oh you man. almost had that. that you shouldn't have stopped. Yeah, bump it and go passenger. Like it, like you mean it. I 
this jeep. Oh, uh, again? God. For the record, this is the worst place that Jeep could have put a license plate bracket. Whoa. Also, just screw this one in. In case you haven't noticed, we do have a spare. It's just in the actual back of the Jeep at the moment. We took it off since we still don't have the reinforcement kit yet. We went ahead and took it off, put it in the back of the Jeep. That way it doesn't catch on anything and completely destroy our tailgate. Holy crap, guys. This thing never ceases to amaze us. <laughs> so we are waiting for the rest of our group to join us. So to kill time, we're gonna go back down and back up again. There you go, you're good. All right, a little bit, driver. Right there, there you go. Perfect. All right. There you go. Keep your wheels just like that. All right. Woo just keep the wheels straight. See what the bumper looks like. <laughs> the <laughs> the plate! I swear to God, why do we even have that thing on here anymore? The bumper actually looks all right. Um, that looks okay. Well, I mean, no. We gonna, gonna pull it. <laughs> Stupid freaking plate. Oh, that one's broken. Oh, we're just gonna have to screw it or zip tied in or something. It's broken. Why would they put the license plate here? I mean, it looks sleeker, but. It, no, oh, look at that. Oh, whoa, no way. We dented we the metal. We dented the steel stock bumper. Sweet. Oh, God. That doesn't line up anymore. <laughs> All right. Let's go back up. Kev, right there. Straighten out and just bump it like you mean it. Oh, gotcha. A little more. There you go. Keep going. All right, two for two. So we're barely okay. rubbing here. It's clear. And then we barely are touching that right there. You can see the, just barely. Yeah, it's pretty dang good. It is pretty dang good. coming down oh perfect yeah there you go just stay nice and straight On this, yeah. That's, On this trail? Wow, that was amazing. Whew, that was awesome! Who's next? Oh, yeah. Look at that grip. Wet. Wet tire, 10 PSI, and it's hugging that rock like it wants its babies. <laughs> All right, another uh, what's Brittany eating today? Brittany does peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, but she shoved it full of sour cream and onion chips. Cause it's delicious. And go have ahead. you ever tried it before? Ask them, not me. Okay, well, if you haven't tried it before, you can shut your trap and you can try it, and then you can complain about it if you still don't like I'm it. I'm not complaining. <laughs> driver. Dang. 
So it's right about this moment that I start to get that super adrenaline rush and my heart starts hammering. You ride? And I just start imagining rolling the Jeep. Basically everyone that we just passed going in the opposite direction to take the bypass recommended that we don't try Cleveland Rock. There she is. Oh man. This is a terrible idea. Like all of our ideas. <laughs> Alright, so I have no idea how I'm supposed to go this. There you go, right there. He's starting to burn oil. Out the tailpipe. All right, go slow. There you go. No, 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 that way. Yeah. 
Can't win you back. <laughs> well, that's, after all that. I can tell you one thing. There's not been another jail in that position in this spot ever. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Stuck between a rock and a hard place. We're going to put this barricade winch to the test. Officially to the test for the first time. You're, you're in an odd position. No, but it feels like... Like if I open the door, it might just like rock. <laughs> yeah, you're a little. That's like Maybe a, you can no, I'll do a shackle. Tell. So he happens. is <laughs> super vertical yeah, and tipped way yeah. that way. <laughs> oh god, this is so sketchy right now. Hey, you should be able to back down now. Go slow. All right. You're going over a rock on your right rear. There you go. Hey, it's always worth a shot. You never know until you try, right? I mean, I mean, obviously we could have winched all the way up, but then we'd have to go back down, which really would have sucked. If we could have made it up on our own part, we would have risked going back down. But if we had to winch up, there's really no point in having to turn around and then risk rolling the Jeep just to get back down it. Ooh, and the rain just started falling. All right, well. Defeated by Cleveland Rock. Unfortunately, we gave it our all. We did get to test out the barricade winch once and for all, and it did freaking well. Where's the cover? Who has the cover? Oh, it's way up there. I'll go grab it. Troy. Troy? Yes. Officially, Brittany. Hey, Josh. Josh, it's a pleasure. Nice to meet you. Thank you for your You're help. Very and welcome. thank you for coming to witness us You're potentially welcome. destroy our Jeep. <laughs> he, couldn't, he couldn't wait until I posted the video. He, he wanted close. to see it in person. He was close. <laughs> we came back around to see it. We made it further up it than I thought we would. I appreciate your help. Yeah, you bet. Yeah, thank you guys. I'm sorry I couldn't get you up Thanks, there. Thanks, Adam. I mean, yeah, man. You know. With the winch, we would have had it. Yeah, but yeah. I tried. There's no fun I, in that. I think we could have probably picked a different line if we had more time, but yeah. I knew this was coming, yeah. so it's just sure. <laughs> and who are you guys with one more time? On Instagram at Four Plane 303 Off Road or Crawl 5280. Crawl 5280. Okay. Cool. All right, you guys yeah. rock. And he's with Crawl Magazine. Yep. Crawl Magazine. Yeah. Literally just started raining right as we came down from the obstacle. <laughs> Oh, our rear bumper is full. <laughs> Didn't quite make it up Cleveland Rock like we were wanting to, but we gave it a really good shot, or several good shots. I tried, <laughs> and holy crap, the whole time I was falling off the damn thing. We were rolling it. So the Jeep I, was rolling. So I wasn't quite on the passenger side on the first attempt he was going up, but when he went up and slid over, there was a three the passenger side was about three inches from, from a, the drop-off, drop -off, which where I would, have rolled. would have rolled the Jeep to the right. And then going up that second one, Obviously, he was super vertical, but not only that, he was super angled to this side. That was just not a very good place to be in at all. It's making me get out in the rain because we've got a good shot here to kind of show you the difference between our 38s and 40s. They're both aired down to 10 PSI, 40 inch tire, 38 inch tire. Ultimately, we are not as upset as we typically would be if we didn't make it up an obstacle. It's definitely one of those you have to kind of see it in person to really gauge the severity of it. If it hadn't started raining, I'm pretty sure Kevin would have said F it and kept at it. I would have. We'll come back again. Oh yeah, no, we're definitely coming back. We're gonna give another shot on another day and we'll probably keep at it until we eventually make it. But I don't know, good shot, good game, good game, good game, good game. You're silly. There you go. Oh my gosh, hold on, don't move. <laughs> oh man. Oh, I'm glad I got out of the car to see that. Broken, 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 broken. 100% of the tabs are broken. Oh, it's because the bumper's completely f***ed. But the yeah. bumper's buckled right here. 
Yeah, so you can see right here. It's buckled. Yeah, that's all sorts of cockeyed. Yeah. It'll be fine as long as it doesn't hit yeah. anything. You say as long as you don't hit anything? Yeah. What are the odds of that? Very low is the answer. The odds are very low. Dang. Well, it's coming down pretty good now. We're waiting on our group. They're behind us, but I don't know where. We don't see them. I don't see anybody. Do we stay or do we go? Ow. Stay, because we'd be assholes if we don't. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I see headlights. Stay. We are going to try to unkink our rear bumper. Uh, try it there first, I guess. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's not right on it anymore. I think that's good. It pulls it. Look, yeah. it was all up into the body right here. The yeah. gap right there's decent. It's back even with, uh, with this bad boy right there. <laughs> it's basically like new. Give it a little. There it goes. There you go. Look at that, almost freaking dead even again. Yeah, check it out. So we are officially back on the road and headed home, but I thought it was worth mentioning that the tires still have zero noise coming off of them on the highway right now. It's fantastic, like absolutely fantastic. Final thoughts on the trail? Well, the cross was pretty amazing. Almost rolled it twice. So. I think that's definitely not for the faint of heart. I'm pretty sure that that's the most trail damage we've yep. gotten on the Jeep. Yeah. in a single trail. Yeah, body like, mounts are smashed, cross members are smashed, <laughs> gas tank skid is smashed. Crossover um, exhaust. The exhaust is smashed. Yeah. Our rear bumper was smashed. Rear bumper smashed. The yeah. license plate bracket is a lost yeah. cause. So anyway, I mean, it's all, and we, it's no all body damage. Yeah, yeah, it's all part for the course. So I'd say overall, despite the Cleveland Rock disappointment, this trail was still a pretty huge success. It's Showing, a fun trail too. Yeah, invite us out if anyone ever wants to go out again. We are we are definitely down to do that trail again. That was a lot of fun. As always, thanks for watching you guys. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Plus, I've also included a link to my Instagram in the description below. Don't forget to follow me on there as well if you want to see some more rad videos and photos of the Jeep, my drift car, and of course, everything else that we do on a rad, awesome daily basis. We will see you next time. Alright. Next year we sheared in half. Holy cow. <laughs> well? Well? Did you have fun? Yeah, it was a good time. Yeah. <laughs>